Hi everybody, my name is Harold, and you probably recognise the instrument I'm playing. This is a guitar. It's certainly the most popular instrument that exists across all the cultures in the whole world. There are literally hundreds of different types of guitars. There are electric guitars, there are bass guitars, dobros or Hawaiian guitars, there are banjos, 12 string guitars, there are semi-acoustic guitars, there are tiny guitars like ukuleles, and there are huge guitars like Mexican guitarons. Apart from electric guitars, all guitars work the same way. You pluck the string, and with the finger or a pick, and this causes the instrument to vibrate and moves the air which makes the sound, which is what we hear. The guitar I'm playing is called a classical guitar. Sometimes it's also called a Spanish guitar, um, even though this one's actually made in Australia. If you want to get technical, we should really call it a nylon string acoustic guitar, because the sound is acoustic, it's made by the instrument without any electronics, and because the strings are all made out of nylon, which is a type of plastic. There are six strings on the guitar, and they're attached to the guitar down here, on this bit, which is called the bridge. It's called the bridge because the vibrations from the strings are transferred, they travel through the bridge into the soundboard, which is what actually makes the sound of the guitar. The strings are also attached to the guitar at the tuning pegs. And the tuning pegs are called tuning pegs because we can use them to tune or change the sound of the strings. If I tighten them, the sound might go up. Or if I loosen them, the sound will go down again. All the strings sound different. The thin strings on this side sound much higher, while the thicker strings on the other side are much lower. To change the sound, the notes, we can actually press on the metal frets, which are attached here at the fingerboard. Each fret has a different note, but careful, as my hand goes down, the sound actually goes up. The guitar can be used for all different types of music, from blues and rock and roll, I'm going to finish with one of my favourite Spanish pieces, written about a hundred years ago, called Memories from the Alhambra. In it, you'll hear two different parts, both played on the one guitar, and it will be a little bit like two instruments playing together. <laughs> 